Greetings everyone, the Animath here, welcome back to my Hearthstone, another week, another Tavern Brawl, and this week, Blood Magic again. How much are you willing to sacrifice for power? All your spells will cost health instead of mana, and we've got a um, discard zoo-ish kind of, I guess. Um, I guess one way to play this is instead of using um, spells, uh, you just completely avoid this mechanic, which is kind of what we're doing here. Got a little bit of um, like you know, some dark bombs in there for some burst, um, use health instead of mana. So, a little bit more bursty in that sense. Um, and obviously trying to take advantage of, uh, you know, opponents want to play spells, it's going to cause health, so Zoo will kind of zerg things down faster. Um, thought about doing um, something else, like a, a DK mage kind of thing, but, you know, we've got, um, we've got a Warlock quest to do, so that's why we're doing Warlock. I'm actually not sure if this is going to... Because it's spend all your mana. But I don't know if that costs mana. Uh, if that's like a mana cost for... Or, you know, because it's zero mana. But anyways, we'll see what's up. Going against uh, another fellow warlock here. It looks like we're going to go to 1-2. Alright. Hit him with the Flame Imp. Deal some damage the old-fashioned way. Uh, to, to myself, that is. <laughs> Alright. Two mana. I mean, spells all got plenty of burst, so. Alright. Interesting, interesting. Tap, tap. Alright. Okay. That's kind of cute, I suppose. Alright, we'll go ahead and just hit him with the thing. Get rid of that. Um, alright. Oh, this is 3-2. Forgot about that. That's cute. Alright, so my opponent's got some uh, fragments, I'm guessing, to offset the spell costs. So we'll see what's up. Alright, bit of a bummer. Alright, uh... Get a couple juggles here, I guess. Do I coin out for two, for four jugs? Sure. Alright. All to the face. Seems legit. Uh, we'll go ahead and bump there, and I guess we tap. So we got some synergy here. Hoping to get, uh, what is it called? Hand of Gul'dan? Soonish, perhaps? Guessing my opponent has plenty of spells. Alright, fair enough. Okay. Uh, I wonder if the Hand of Gul'dan discarding off this works. I think I'm just gonna drop this. Ugh. Let's do this to see what's up first. There's a handful, Dan. Interesting, interesting. Okay. What well, if I just drop this and this? I could throw this out. Um, we'll get rid of that. Plenty of discards. It's a lot of cards. Um, I guess. Alright. This is going to be kind of weird. I mean, my opponent definitely has plenty of removal at uh, their disposal. Given, you know, spells are free and there's plenty of uh, AoE spells. Alright, gains one health overall. Hit him with a tap. Dark bomb. Alright, alright. That's fine. I already drawn like a third of my deck off of these guys, those guys. So I guess we can toss this out. Um, do I want to discard for another three cards? I don't think I want to. I guess I could throw out a dark bomb. I think I'm just going to play these guys out. So I kind of wanted to save this for that, but, you know. 
No, did you say shh? It's still asleep. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> All right. Six cards, right, with the tap. So we'll see what's up. Siphon. All right. Another tap. Sure, sure, sure. Looks like my opponent's just got a bunch of those uh, thingamabobbers that heal up, right? All right. I think we'll go ahead and just throw this and that. Go ahead and sack here. Bump, bump. Way too many hands of Gul'dan. At some point when the Doom Guards come out, I'm going to be drawing way too many cards. <laughs> All right, second Siphon. Bad. I know a soul when I smell it. All right. After you play a man, he doesn't count as summon a minion, I believe. So easily. All right. Not enough burst, unfortunately. I could throw some of this out for some burst potential, right? Because I have double Doom Guard. So I got three, seven Doom Guard if I don't discard. So what I could do is just go for it. Um. Okay, and there we go, boys. Just for the lols, I guess. It's still good. All right, and gotta pretend like we got. Oh, we just got it off the top. Oh my gosh, how's that even possible? All right, well, it works. I think my opponent, like I said, mostly just played uh, a healing deck. I think there's definitely a lot better ways to, to construct something, like, if we were to go, like, I don't know, you can do some sort of mage shenanigan, I suppose, um, if we were to build a mage deck. This is the other thing I was going to think about, right, like, can you do something OTK-ish, so like, maybe Ant uh, Antonitis, <clears throat> once we go to wild, because I believe that was wild, um, I would have to convert this deck to a wild first, right? Like, can you do some sort of... But then you don't have enough... It's four mana for... It's four health for six damage. So... You know. You can do Antonitis. You can do some Fireballs. Uh, fireballs. What other direct damage spells are there? To a minion. To a minion. Minion. Do, 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 do. I mean, you can do this... And, I mean, technically you could do this. Uh, deal two damage, discover a spell. That's possible to get more damage off of that, more burst. Got some torches. Um, where's Pyro? I mean, Firelands. That's more, more health than damage, though, so maybe we'll hold off on that. Uh, I got some Pyros in there. Yeah, I don't know. Didn't have the brain power right now to think through this, but, you know, a lot of draw, a lot of stall. I mean, ice block. Right? And then you just do draw and stall. Uh, oops. What do we want? We want ice block. We already got that. Um, uh, you can also do the thing that makes you immune on your turn, right? This chap or gal, um, and then using a lot of draw. Not drawing secrets. Draw one card, prove a spell damage. Uh, what are we doing? We could do that. Could do that. Um, because these are just ways to cycle through your deck, right? Some spells. Draw two cards. Refresh. Draw two cards. Refresh two mana crystals for each spell drawn. I mean, you could do that. 
Yeah, that's a little too conditional, though, right? Because, like, you need to be able to... I think this kind of almost depends on getting the Violet Illusionist out, because you have to be able to survive all this <laughs> damage you're potentially doing to yourself. Uh... I don't know. This is probably bad, but <laughs> something like this. Sure, for spell damage. I don't know. Whatever. Um, that's something could potentially be be done. I'm sure someone probably labbed it out and there's a better version of it, or there's some version of it that can totally work. Um, I'm sure there's some meta for this uh, Tavern Brawl. It's already been, you know, most of the week. It's been like, what, f uh, four days now? Five days since it came out? So I'm sure there is some outstanding meta, not just like some random OTT that you can do with the the health uh, or spells costing health instead of mana. Um, I'm not in a state to lab it out right now, but I'm sure there is. But this works, right? Going mostly minion based still works too, with a little bit of a burst in here um, from the spells. Uh, totally worked. And so, yeah, not too uh, crazy, but you know, it gets the job done. And at the end of the day, that's what we want. So, until next time, thanks for watching.